Hey there, Mojo Pin 12, showing you the front yard. Uh, I'm kind of doing this over again because I usually don't have people traveling around. Um, but as soon as I start the video, it seems like all my neighbors are coming around to say hi. So <laughs> um, this is just uh, kind of a wild flower garden thing that I I, I did in the front here. Um, and not not planting. I only planted a pumpkin uh, plant right here, so that's coming out and doing pretty well. But I do have uh, tomato plants and peppers. So once again, going along that lines of using uh, pots, small pots to maximize the small space that I have here, and I put together a. Uh, flower garden, flower rock garden. Um, it's doing pretty well and got these neat um, called bugle weed and it's pretty neat. It kind of looked kind of ugly when I first bought it but they said it was gonna sprout these bugle type flowers and so it is. It's pretty pretty cool looking. Um, and then I get these blue chip flowers, which are kind of cool. I don't know why they call them blue chip, because they're uh, actually purple. Although they look blue on the video camera, so I don't know. Um, and the day lilies that the uh, deer ate, and then I have my echinacea plant. So basically what my goal is, I won't be able to do it this year, but I'm going to start it this year is I'm gonna line my whole front end of the property here. Um, you know, make a wall, a little wall, rock wall. And then in the front here where I have the my struggling rose bush, um, my two rose bushes. And then this uh, flower plant that I did inside, uh, inside this, um, old piece of uh, cement block. Well, basically, I'm going to wrap this with a lot of uh, medicinal flowers. I'm going to look up all the different types of medicinal flowers and um, plenty of echinacea and and I will continually grow pumpkins out here. I, this is another pumpkin plant just doing really awesome. I'm pretty happy with it. And I took a uh, an old pot that my neighbor had that the bottom broke out. So I flipped it over and filled it with dirt, dug a hole underneath as well. Filled it with dirt and now I get some really hardy pumpkin plants coming out. They're kind of evil plants. <laughs> they just creep along grabbing and yanking other things down with their little feelers. It's kind of, it's a pretty good plant to be used as a sim symbolic to Halloween I have to say. I mean look at them. It's, it's like reaching out right now and going to strangle this plant. And rip him down as it advances down my lawn. But that's the plan. That's the plan what I'm going to do with the front yard. That'll be uh, next year. Um, and hopefully I'll have lots of cross-pollination, and I'll have a whole front yard full of edible and medicinal plants. So, Alright, that's pretty much it. And maybe I'll do some videos of, uh, of the lake, which is, uh, you can probably see it from here. Yeah, too much tree cover. Alright. That's it. Later.
Governor sprung from jail The Senate is down 